What is up, y'all? See, I'm not in a good mood. Why? Because I've reacted to this. Who TikTok made the Grimace Shake a horror trend? Hmm, let me get my Grimace Shake. <laughs> like, bruh. Really? Really? You're going nuts over a giant blob that used to exist in the 70s. Like, dude. Oh, hold up. By grabbing a milkshake. Happy birthday, Grimace! Oh, Oh dear god, it's right, because they drank the Grimace shake, bro. See, this is what they did. What's up, y'all? Today we're going to be drinking the Grimace shake. This looks very mid and pretty purple and probably will give me diabetes, but I still want to drink it. Uh... Like, bro, it's not funny. It's just stupid. So for those of you who don't know, TikTok has this thing where they like to turn random things into mysterious pieces of horror. Like, have you ever seen those Family Guy clips on top of Subway Surfer gameplay? Yeah, well, if you didn't know, that's a horror rabbit hole. And now it seems as if Grimace, the purple mascot from McDonald's, is receiving... The Grimace is a purple dinosaur from our imaginations, and when you see him, he's gonna pull out a Glock, and he's gonna shoot you. Bang, bang, bang. Like, bro, this fat monster looks like he just wants to hurt kids and give them milkshakes, bro. Really? We're, re we're really talking about Grimace. Oh. Same fate. Over the past few weeks, social media has been run rampant with a horror trend known as the Grimace Shake Incident, where those who consume the latest McDonald's menu item will be met with a mysterious unknown horror. Bro, ski mask boy, oh my god. That's how you know it's staged, bro. It's like, y'all, hey, give me the 10,000 likes and I can break out of jail. Otherwise, I'm going to be stuck with that guy. Please help me. Please help me. Like, dude, you're not doing anything but looking cringe. This trend has exploded over the past few days, resulting in dozens of videos, news articles, and even a comment from McDonald's themselves. But before we take a look at this trend, let's quickly dive into the history of Grimace, as I think it really adds to the humor of what's going on here. And also because some people don't even know who Grimace is. They don't actually die, bro. It's just TikTok. It's just the, hey, y'all, I want attention and likes. I'm going to drink the Grimace shake, yeah, and let's hope Grimace doesn't haunt me. Bad news, buddy, he's going to get you. Which frankly disappoints me. Back in 1972, Grimace, known as... That looks like if Barney and Ursula had a baby, bro. Like, wh what is this? You got my boy Ronald McLaughlin in the back with Mr. Mayor Cheeseburger, who probably is going to get sniped like he did in Family Guy. And you got Ursula and Barney's little baby that they made when they were going at it all night, bruh. Evil Grimace was first introduced to the McDonald's crew as a villain of the McDonald's franchise. He had four arms and would steal necessary supplies from McDonald's, such as... Wait, what? Huh? Ronald, bro, we ain't safe anymore, bro. He, it looks like he's still in ketchup holders. It's for food. However, McDonald's soon found this version of Grimace to be too scary for children at the... How is... How is a... Nah, the little kid's like, Mommy, it's too scary. Yeah. Bro, kid, oh my god. If you're scared of a little monster, then I don't know how you're going to grow up and realize the truth, bro. Time, so to better emphasize a family-friendly fast food chain, they decided to rebrand Grimace as a dopey, lovable purple character. I'm Grimace, I'm Grimace. And you look real dumb. In terms of what he was, McDonald's announced that he was the embodiment of a milkshake and that looks trash. That's just, that's a purple styrofoam cup with whipped cream and blueberries. Decided to make Grimace the shake mascot. However, they later would have... Yes, this is Grimace. Yeah, that's what he's doing with those shakes. Now, that this isn't the case, as a McDonald's manager in Canada would reveal that Grimace is a giant taste bud. Many of the McDonald's mascots would seem to be lost with time. Even Ronald himself. Many of the classic and unique staples of McDonald's advertising soon became a thing of the past. 
Until now. Since he was born, Grimace has always had a birthday. In June of 2023, McDonald's would launch an advertising campaign for Grimace's birthday. It first started on June 5th when McDonald's Twitter got taken over by Grimace. Grimace would post that he has an announcement on June 6th and the text him at... Seven oh seven, okay. All right, numbers in my phone, let's call it. Oh, surprise, I'm taking over. Ew. Oh, no. Number. This would kickstart the first wave of Grimace memes, however, these were a lot more tamer and friendly. On June 12, Grimace would announce that it's his birthday, and McDonald's would release a commercial featuring many of the old McDonald mascots to promote the all-new Grimace birthday meal. And this time around, they even seemed to double down on his family-friendly nature, showing Grimace throughout the years celebrating his birthday with an innocent and adorable childlike touch. While the campaign was used to promote the new meal, the true star of the campaign was the brand new purple grimace milk so it's just a shamrock shake but purple shake. the reception of the shake was both good and bad the good thing is that the shake was actually pretty good the, the shake was artificially flavored and had so much sugar that it gave kids diabetes and then they eventually died because they had diabetes and wouldn't stop eating sugar because their parents kept giving them gatorade Bad is that they're now using this fictional character's likeness who they've almost abandoned for the past decade to now sell fries, nuggets, and a shake for almost twenty dollars. Please, you're kid you're kidding me. No, that can't be real. I don't know if you can read that. Twenty-one dollars in some places. Oh, no, nah, bro. I don't care for Grimace. No, I'm pulling on a Glock 18. I don't even give that much money to my nephews on their birthday. However, no one seems to be talking about the price. No one seems to be talking about the shape. All that people are talking about is the fate of those poor individuals. Oh, ew. Bro really bought... $500 worth of Grimace shakes and decided we gotta splay them all over the room, yo. Yeah, a real good idea, dude. You decided, let me waste my money on a pointless shake that's not even that good, and then bam. Like, bruh. To take a sip of the Grimace milkshake. TikTok, it seems. Bro, that hand reminds me of the blue people, the three dudes. So you can paint yourself blue, yellow, but what about... Let me, let me go get my paint real quick. Adopt the trend that drinking from the forbidden berry juice that is the Grimace Shake will result in a painful and agony... Oh my... <sighs> Don't freak out. It's just a trash trend made by teens who don't know a thing about what they're doing. Bro just decided, let me waste more Grimmy Shake and pour it all in my car. Bruh. Eyes and death. What I love is how everybody agreed on a universal rule to not show the cause of death. Some of these depict the drink as being a likely poison. But guys, they were trying to Grimmy Shake. Bro was a faucet that just decided. Bro just can't stop leaking water. Hey guys, we're gonna try the Grimace shake. Shout out to Grimace. Happy birthday. Let's try it out. Oh my gosh. It's literally so good. Oh my god, guys. It's so good. Oh. Ah! <sighs>
Oh, yeah, no, nah, now you're dead because he said, let me flip my wings and we like wimmies, boys. Yeah, no, you bruh. Hey, guys, I'm here at McDonald's. I'm trying the Grimace shake. You know, I've seen a lot of trends on it, so I'm just going to get going with it. If he makes a mess in this McDonald's, I'm walking away. <laughs> Others has Grimace murdering those who taste his shake. We just got the Grimace shakes. Happy birthday, Grimace! Oh, shit. Billy! Billy! That wasn't even Grimace. That was just them grabbing a purple shirt. Like, what? Okay, guys, let me try the Grimace shake. Happy birthday, Grimace. Like, like, what is this? Dude? What is this? What What are we doing now, bro? What's next? Are we going to get the, the shamrock shake and be like, Oh, no, there's little leprechauns. Yeah, because everyone's just going to get high and be like, Oh, my God, there's a bunch of leprechauns on the ground. When it turns out it's just a bunch of short people and you've been... Killing short people, and now you're going to jail. Alright, so I got the new Grimace. When can I walk away and quit? Um, anyway, I'm really nervous at this one because that's you. It's actually pretty cool. And the rest are an odd mix of weird and obscure deaths. Not, I'm really enjoying this gumshake. I haven't seen all these crazy TikToks. I think you guys are reacting. Nothing bad's happened to me yet. Mm. You know, I think we really nailed this. It kind of tastes like... Um, happy birthday, Grimace! When did we all of a sudden just decide, oh yeah, y'all, because we tried to grim shake, let's put bags over people's heads and then just have them like in car trunks and chairs. They clearly can't breathe, so what's the problem? What I love most about this is the fact that McDonald's just cannot escape the trope that Grimace is a horror villain. After years of remark- Well, he looks like Barney, and that's already a villain. Being in a decade-long hiatus, even the new generation of kids still turn to horror when creating content around Grimace. The poor kid just can't catch a break. Honestly, though, I do not- Dude's like a 40-year-old old man. I think McDonald's is complaining one bit. The Grimace meal would likely have fallen into obscurity- EDP? What's he doing here? If not for this trend. Especially given the fact that this thing costs as much as a Texas Roadhouse steak. I do give massive props to the social media team behind McDonald's as they seem to be somewhat embracing the meme by mentioning it in a recent tweet that says, Me pretending I don't see the Grimace shake trend. And that's pretty much it. Just a bunch of people dying from a... Oh yeah, and then all of a sudden the very next day, What's up guys? Today we're gonna be doing the... The pretend to be a Mr. Beast clone because we want to be as cringe as possible. You know, we were already cringe yesterday when we made the Grimace shake, and now we gotta be as cringe as we possibly can. I hope you like, subscribe, and you better comment on your favorite part, because I don't know. I don't, I don't get the point of this trend, bro. Have a good day.